136 days into the next Bitcoin halving cycle. It's your boy Crypto Millie back with our early one family. Yes, I am out and away from the studio. As soon as I get back to the studio, guys, we'll be back on our regular schedule. Until then, bear with me. We'll be back on the camera and everything. But let's talk about a few cryptocurrencies under the top narratives because I got a, I got a, I got a, I got a surprise for you guys, right? Um, you are seeing right now a lot of the mid caps and high caps pumping a lot of people been asking me Millie what's going on with the low caps what's going on with the small cap gems we're seeing Bitcoin pump ETH pump and some of these blue chip mid coins pump but we're not seeing those massive moves just yet from these smaller caps or micro caps and I'm here to tell you family be patient be patient understand that crypto does work in cycles all right so this is the crypto uh, money flow cycle it goes from fiat to bitcoin to large caps to mid caps then to small caps and back to bitcoin and then back into fiat and this cycle just is a revolving door revolving door so right now we got fiat going into bitcoin and a lot of those bitcoin profits going into large cap and once these large caps make their profits they're going to mid caps but this is where it gets interesting family once the mid caps get that profit and get that green light all of that beautiful liquidity and profits we've seen over the last 18 months will flow into small caps and again this is another example of the crypto money cycle the s p 6900 version um s p bitcoin large cap mid caps small caps i would say small caps and i would even say meme coins because i feel like the last sector that usually is a top signal is the hype that we see from meme coins so um, this is my um, narrative list right here. We're going to be talking about top cryptocurrencies in each narrative. I'll even give you a bonus narrative, um, which I'll just give you an honorable mention right now, which are launch pads. I like what do you mean token? And of course, the LSD narrative liquid staking derivatives. I like stuff like um, Libra Finance and maybe or maybe a hyped up uh, lending in a borrowing protocol like tectonic you know it has a lot of hype behind it so those are honorable mentions but let's talk about the main narratives make sure that you guys like subscribe hit that notification bell and keep your favorite crypto and door to door entrepreneur inside the algorithms also we made an update on the patreon about elliot trades and alex becker's wallet so make sure you check out those links in the description elliot uh, Elliot just got rid of all of that USDC, about $186,000 worth. So is he getting prepared to drop some of this 180 into the market? Is it time that Elliot Trades starts buying? We talked about it in the Patreon. Make sure you check out the links in the description. Without further ado, let's get into these crypto coins top crypto coins to buy before 2024 of course this is not financial advice now we are seeing low caps and small caps kind of like correct and um, we've seen massive moves on the month from some of these projects relio network went up from 13 cent all the way up to at 1.80 cents so massive move starting to put in a little bit of correction but this may be your chance to get into the premier right the premier rwa token which is relio giving um the little shrimps like us an opportunity to have exposure to um tokenization right real world assets at a massive scale stuff like corporate real estate real estate on watches luxury cars whatever it may be to be tokenized on a blockchain relio will allow um, an opportunity to retail like us opposed to these investments being specifically for heavy centralized and entities that what well, we want to say get first mover advantage right i feel like relio is one of the uh top rwa projects and for that reason you know i think it since it's correct, and this may be a perfect opportunity down 13% on the day to get in. Um, I do hold Relio, and I got into Relio at 13 cent. So I'm um, not going to give you guys a full review. If you want a full review, let me know. Links in the description. Market cap is not correct on here, and the name of this website is Coin Market Cap. So again, they have no freaking idea what they're doing. But from the uh, surface of things, I think Relio is a great project from a fundamental standpoint. A very bullish team. Um, these guys seem like they plan on taking uh, cryptocurrency serious. The only um, cons of the RWA uh, market are, are these are specifically security tokens. So it would be the um, clarity we need on stuff like regulation and compliance. I also like Galeo Protocol. 
um leox is also a great rwa pro uh, project and we set um aka we coins uh, i'm giving you guys two or three in the sector for you to pick and again go do your research miria another gaming project right that we've seen do massive moves it's finally starting to correct here on the month it, it hit one penny it did hit one penny at one point so salute to the people that got into miria down here this is a studio in infrastructure playing gaming that's allowing you true ownership it also scales ethereum by being a layer two so in my opinion an infusion between imx and gala and this project is prime for a blast off right sitting at a 78 million dollar market cap we've seen how well naka did i think i think miria will um will um duplicate the success we've seen from naka because i mean you if you bought down here you literally started from the bottom and now you're here so go do your research on miria i think it's one of the hottest gaming projects in the gaming sector right gaming sector gaming i like miria i like dubs i like um compete i like gfal play zap it's a lot to choose from um nakamoto we talked about that gala even you know probably could still pump so you know go do your research on some of these gaming tokens i think it's a narrative that you need to have exposure going into 2024 we went over the stats how gaming could be one of those sectors that could see extreme growth and for that reason i think that we need to focus on you know some gaming projects at least have some exposure inside your uh portfolio so you can pick the gaming project you like the best I like Miri. I'm invested in Miria. Y'all let me know what y'all think about Miri. And what is your favorite gaming project? Let me know in the comments. That's why. That's how I know you watched the video to the end. Um, AI. So we got Pal AI. Um, another AI project that I feel is correcting right now, right? If we go back over to the month. Um, very, very stable in the month. But nice moves down here from one penny to 14 cent. We've seen massive gains here with Pal AI. It's literally being integrated throughout cryptocurrency. Every cryptocurrency is using the Pal bot. Every influencer that has a Telegram, every anybody that has a Discord, they're at some point interacting or integrating Pal AI. You can just go down to Twitter. I just go down to Twitter and see. The multiple things that these guys are working on and i know they're they're rolling out some updates they got some updates on the way some powerful ai updates but you could just go down the twitter and see all of the partnerships they literally get three or four partnerships each day this is demand this is what you want to see oh we talked about this project in, in patreon moros i would pay attention to moros if you don't know what moros is go do your research very small cap bonance i mean these guys partner with any and everybody not saying that's very good thing but it does bring exposure to pal ai um we're proud to announce that pal ai is a gold sponsor at one of the world's biggest ai summits so they, they'll be at an ai summit man it's in this project is literally everywhere they have partnership with nvidia i think that this project is prime for a one billion dollar market cap right one billion dollar market cap just based off integration right now, what we're sitting at, uh, $100 million market cap. So a 10X from here, 10X from here. If you got in early, I'm like my like myself, salute to you. Um, but the AI narrative, I mean, you can't lose with the AI narrative. I mean, we just seen what, what Elon Musk was, <laughs> the bull run is back, right? We just seen what Elon Musk and his boys was out there doing with the, um, with AI and, and the Teslas, right? The Teslas truck. I mean, look at this, man. You know what I mean? Uh, we don't know if this is CGI or if it's real. But, I mean, they out here giving AI weapons. <laughs> what if AI just said, you know what? Screw this. But, um, yeah, AI is, 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 is going to be a massive hit, man. At this point, how can you ignore the AI narrative? You can't ignore the AI narrative. I mean, Elon Musk is doing so much with AI. You know, this is... This is just insane, man. Insane. Insane. Raising the roof, right? So I think AI narrative is here to stay. I think it's going to be one of the strongest narratives. And pal, AI has corrected. These are top cryptocurrencies to get in before 2024. Ones that have, have been the hottest, have been the strongest, have showed incredible strength throughout the bear in accumulation stage. And I feel like they're still prime, prime to go. Just like people feel like Casper can still can run up. I, just, I mean, I know these or in some cases running into hundreds of million dollars market cap but i mean ai is about to be explosive so if you sleep a fade ai where do you live at under a rock i mean come on man um pal ai um banana is another good one great great sniper bot great 
utility behind that. Um, AGIX has been going crazy. The whole singularity ecosystem is insane. Um, Chlor AI, so many just so many so many good projects out there. Go do your research. Go do your research. All right. Mm. Layer twos, infrastructure. Layer ones. I like Bitrock. I like Bitrock. I think Bitrock is sitting here at a nine million dollar market cap, so it hasn't seen the insane runs like some of these projects in our uh, narrative portfolio. But again, um, layer twos, layer ones. I mean, Bitrock. I mean, you might can even choose Casper if you feel like Casper's going to run. I like Bitrock because the potential nine million dollar market cap. They also have their own swap. They have a seamless interoperable swap that allows you to um, swap any cryptocurrency. Um, despite it being on a native chain so that that's going to be huge because you don't see any other layer twos doing that they also have cryptocurrencies that you can actually mint on in their ecosystem so this is a project right where you can actually like um make projects make projects they have a a whole chain right they have a whole chain if you go to dex tools you can go to bitrock chain and see what type of meme coins and utility tokens are being built within the bitrock um chain here so um very very bullish on um, bitrock here um you can see their main net is live their swap is live and what i like about this project for for a project that in my opinion team is not docs they have been executing and i think that if the team came out and just doxed itself this thing would easily fly to 100 million dollar market cap i think that's the one thing in today's crypto maybe two or three years ago people didn't care but ever since the FTX and everything that's going on, we've seen with, man, I can name so many cryptos where, you know, you it looked like everything is looks beautiful for this project. And then, bam, you know what I'm saying? So you always got to have that speculation with a project when the team is not docking. Unfortunately, because I really, really like this project and I think that it's going to do well. Too many big people behind it. But, but that's the only red flag right they got swapped these are some of the cryptocurrencies man the ecosystem is growing they didn't even have this much cryptocurrencies in the beginning so definitely like what bit bit swap um bit rock I mean, bit swap bit rock can become right man if this thing runs to a one billion dollar market cap like we see from many layer twos that would be an incredible gain and we know polygon started from the bottom right polygon started from the bottom and then blew up so keep that in mind last but not least GambleFi. So I know a lot of people like Hilo, Robit. Um, right now we're embedded into uh FXI Sports. Now that the heights of this project, I mean, yesterday it was at a twelve million dollar market cap. It has pulled back a little bit again. So be aware of these pullbacks. This project is infusion AI technology into GambleFi. So really, 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 really great utility here. Um, this allows you to utilize AI to um help win your bets. Right, help predict live sports so definitely something that i would do your you know do research on um they have this cool technique um where they're literally um gaming gamifying live matches so look how insane this is you know you're watching a live match you swing over to x and x F fx1 you generate a gamified version of the live match and you bet against your peer um based on hits based on you know whoever wins the fight Truly, truly, truly unique and niche. But what is crypto? Crypto is a casino. What do we do every day in crypto? We literally gamble. So when you add one of the hottest narratives behind it, which is AI, now you got, you know, a recipe for success. I feel like FX1, um, they, they're working on partnerships with streaming services. This project, you know, if you like sports, if you're into like fantasy sports, stuff like that, this is a legit utility, right? This is a legit use case for a cryptocurrency project that actually makes sense. So um, utilizing FX1 token, and not just their token, but even real cash to bet peer to peer, peer to peer in the um, sports world and utilizing cryptocurrency, making it a, a decentralized bet opposed to some of these centralized entities like DraftKings and and what's the another one? Um, FanDuel, all of these things that at any given day they can just close down and say you're out of your account, you're locked out of your account, you, you can't get the money out of your account. Um, you know this doesn't happen with decentralized entities. So I think decentralization in casinos and and betting makes sense. We're early two thousand holders, nine million dollar market cap. 
684,000 liquidity. Do your research on this project. Do your research on this project, man. It's been pumping. Um, nice. We're up nice. We've been talking about this project for at least two, three weeks now. So FX1 is, you know, crypto gamify. If you miss roll bit, right, I would look at high low. If you feel like you miss high low, I would look at FX Sports. If you feel like FX Sports pump too much, another good one is um, De Niro. De Niro is also a good one. And if you're into, like, niche type of betting, I would look at something like um, Crown, which is horse horse race um, betting right here. Where is it? Crown. <clears throat> is this the Crown token right here? Um, let's see. Crown, Crown. 49 million official finish. yeah uh, which uh, crown is the official utility token of photo finish live which is the official game of the K kentucky derby so this is like game ai gamblefy all infused into um one cryptocurrency right so it's also built on solana one of the hottest chains in the world right now and photo photo finish live this is a pretty um big company here right they made a game um, after the Kentucky Do Derby, says Photos Finish Live is a play to earn virtual horse racing ecosystem where you can race against other real life owners and create generations and generations of unique offspring featuring the most advanced simulated genetic breeding algorithm in the world. So the people who love uh, horse racing and love creating, right? It's kind of like those games where you can build up your own city or those Pokemon games where you literally um, are breeding and, and building up your Pokemon. The same thing you can do here. With these horses right you can breed and create the fastest horse in the world and then you can uh bet on simulated uh derby races so wow wow right wow so so many different utilities and use cases here with crypto um this is one that i've just started doing research on but it really really intrigues me and you'd be surprised how many people like horses or into horses and you can see they got some pretty good vc companies behind them Hence the reason they're sitting at a $40 million mark cap. But nobody knows about this project. And that's the reason I think that it's extremely early here for Crowd Token. Liquidity is kind of dry, though. Man, would love to see more liquidity. That's kind of dry compared to that market cap. But outside of that, and FDV is pretty hot. Liquidity sucks, though. But outside of that, um, do your research, man. Do your research. And, again, I don't think these are the correct stats for Crown. I would go to, like, maybe Coin Market Cap. Yeah, so yeah, fifty million dollar, um, fifty million um market cap here, seventy one cent. Uh, this thing pumped too. This thing pumped. I would kind of like wait for it to correct, but we seen what high, low, and dubs. You really don't know when these things will correct. So find the next crowd, right? This is crown. Um, if you feel like crown pumped too much, they got D race out there. You know, a lot of people are looking at D race. That's another like horse niche all right i'm done talking about horse niche i'm really not into the horse thing you know what i mean but a lot of people are so i just wanted to bring that to your attention y'all let me know what y'all think about these cryptocurrencies man some are new some we never talked about some i'm just bringing on the uh channel and if you did that dj and stuff check out the links in the description i'm done here um go find your own tokens you know copy the narratives but find your own tokens and we didn't talk about meme coins because there's so many meme coins and the real meme coin that's gonna pump won't be here till after the halving cycle, right? So a lot of people are bang, betting on these meme coins. Now, I'm betting on a meme coin that's going to be launched after the halving cycle when everybody truly believes we're in a bull market. We're going to see a meme coin be launched about some type of narrative, and it's going to go literally parabolic. So I will buy that meme coin. You guys can hold your old meme coins. I'm not really into old meme coins at all, literally at all. So... You guys do what you do with that. And, um, yeah, we'll find that meme coin. It's your boy Crypto Millie. I'll see you in the next one.